Здравствуйте, товарищи, and welcome back to another episode of our glorious KGB Let's Play. I know it's been a little bit of time since we dove back into this. I think I ended up skipping an episode, unfortunately. I do apologize, but I hope you understand. There was a lot of early access stuff going on. A lot of stuff I had to get out uh, based on embargo dates and timelines. And also, unfortunately, again, uh, the other Let's Plays kind of got put on the back burner. But we should be back on track now. Everything should be moving forward at full speed. On which note, we're actually going to kick this session off with some serious action right away as there is a mission that we want to dive into. Um, if I pop into San Diego, we're going to take care of this Beholder Cell. We've already done our Tactical Recon, so that's the plan to kick things off. Just one thing I want to take care of first is that uh, I'd like to... Well, I'm thinking of getting myself the Control Phrase improvements. It'll take 10 hours. I'm also thinking of getting myself the... Uh, well, there's something that reduces the cost of interrogation. So I'm thinking of doing those two. One takes 10 hours, so I'm thinking of doing the control phrase improvements first, so we'll have them in time for when we capture our next agents. And then I'm also thinking of doing the Faraday cages and holding cells, just to help reduce, again, like it literally, literally says, reduce the danger buildup when we have enemy agents at the HQ. Uh, we've got a lot of money, so I'm not too worried about spending it, but let's get the control phrase improvements going on right now, just because it's sort of quick. Um, I mean, actually, the Faraday cages are faster, but... I'd like to get this done and out of the way first. Uh, apart from that, there was actually an excellent suggestion as far as the crew is concerned, the, the agents are concerned. The ones that I've grown attached to, such as Theremin and Indigo and all, um, I should customize them. I should go in and customize the agents, suit them up and, and dress them up the way I'd like them to look and feel, uh, which is a great suggestion. And I will do that, but I think I'll do that uh, for the Sunday session. That way I'll have Saturday to kind of like sit down and pick and choose and be a bit more thorough with it uh, rather than feel a little rushed because as you all know, day job and all that. So excellent suggestion. Thank you very much for that. And another suggestion was actually that I should uh, pull back Kodiak for a little bit and give him some more training. Like maybe we swap out contact tactics with something a bit more viable so he's out there using some weapons that are actually you know helpful I've never used blinding laser never felt the need to I think I might have used it once uh, and I don't think I really care for pain stimulus because ideally we're not getting hit so uh, let's see if there's something better I mean we could give him the m12 we could give him access to the m10 um, I, I like this gives him the eye for talent it's kind of again I like to role play a little bit so it does fit with him being the commander of the cell, it does kind of work, and it gives us the M12 there. Um, so there's a lot of options that I feel like are fitting. Uh, bargain and killing spree are not bad, but I do think uh, I do think we'll swap this contact tactics out for night operations. Give him an eye for talent. Uh, that, that feels a little useless. I'm not gonna lie. It does feel a little useless, doesn't it? The other option again is if I wanted to be carrying. Uh, a machine gun, like an actual full-on machine gun. I could give him intermediate firearms drill. TKBs are pretty good. RP4 versus the... What is it? RP4 versus the G3. What is better? What is better? So we've got... Uh, there's the G3. 68, 98, 74. Where is the RP4? I do, there we go. Okay, so the RP4 is better, but it does not have firing modes. It's only the one firing mode. Whereas the G3 does have firing modes, and it's only slightly worse as far as damage is concerned. Oh, the clip size is tiny, though. All right, so we want to get him on the RP4 because of that bigger clip size. That's my concern with the Sparrow as well. It does not have that clip size that I like. Um, so we said we want to get him on the RP4, was it? Sorry, just clicking around a little bit here. Yes, RP4. RP4, RP4. Let's swap contact tactics out for intermediate firearms drill. Gives him the TKB and the RP4. Let's swap that. It'll take a day and 12 hours. 750 bucks, but I do think it's worth it. Just, I was never using, like, A, this gives us proficiency with a sparrow anyway, and B, I was never using contact tactics, um, the abilities that come with it. So, with that done, one last thing to take care of, and that's Theremin's perk over here. I'm tempted to give him martial artist just because he is, eventually, when he gets uh, interconnected, I want him to be back in the role of the, you know, actor in disguise martial artist now faster movement is tempting because then he'll get from point a to point b faster but when things hit the fan i'd like him to have minimal reduction in awareness from all the takedowns he's doing so i think i'm going to give him martial artist all right there we go so he's an actor well he's a survivor actor martial artist 
who's constantly in disguise. But not for this next mission, though. Not for this mission in San Diego, as Clover is going to be in disguise for us. Um, we're not in Canada this time. Really? Uh, is this all we've... Sure, let's go with this. Um, and most of us... or Yeah, uh, about a 50-50 split about who speaks the language and who doesn't. I could swap some people out. Uh, is there anybody else I'd like to take on this? Colossus, you're pretty low on hit points. Mercury's forging. Apollo's away. Zenith, low on hit points. Okay, fine. I guess I've got the A-team here, kind of. Falcon out there with the lockpicks and the first aid kit. Clover in disguise with the double PPKs. We got Indigo in there, Frag Grenade, Smoke Grenade, Suppressed TKB. We got a Suppressed M10, an Allowed M10 here. Heavy Vest, Frag and Smoke. First Aid Kit, Frag. Yeah, First Aid Kit, Smoke. And then Suppressed TKB here, and then Suppressed everything over here. So pretty good there. We've got number 15 as the smoke screen. Needles in charge of the sniper. That's the thing, I could take Needles out on the field, actually, though I don't feel like hearing him cussing into my ear right now, so let's not. And we've got our two spotters. This should be a pretty smooth mission, hopefully, unless I launch a smoke grenade when I mean to use my spotter. Maybe I should... You know what? I'm going to blame number 15 for that. He misunderstood the order. Uh, Are we good to go? She's in disguise. Yes. Let's go. Let's take care of this as quickly and smoothly as possible. Maybe we can get a second mission in here. And what I'd like to do actually is after this mission is completed, I think I'm going to take a look at some of the uh, investigation boards that we've got going on because I think there's some good stuff to unlock. And I think we're pretty close to actually getting to the next stage of the story as well. Let's take a look at this uh, mission here. We do have some a camera terminal up here. Again, I just need to take care of one and they all shut down. So let's not focus on camera terminals. Let's focus on loot and intel. I would like to pick up as much intel as possible this mission. There's some uh, over here on the second floor here. Some down here. I'm, I'm guessing this is where we're going to deploy. Because there's some loot down here. There's some loot up here. Uh, there's some loot up here. Alright. Pretty well put together. This is also an old... Um, and more loot up here. We, we've been on this map before, I'm pretty sure. I do wish there were more maps. I'm seriously starting to feel the uh, the repetition lately, which isn't ideal. Like, I don't... I don't hate it. It's not, like, game-breaking for me, but it is starting to get a little, like, okay, can we get a patch or an update that has just at least a couple more maps to cycle through or something? All right, so I spotted a lot of loot. There's one intel piece over here. Now, if I rotate... And more intel over here. I wish I could drop down waypoints or something. I, I like that we can't, but I wish I could. So I've seen two pieces of intel and lots of pieces of loot on the first floor and some on the second floor up here. Okay, cool. I think I think we're good to deploy over here. Now let's take a look at these windows. I think we should get somebody on the north side here looking this way, through this glass as well, through this glass over here. Some pretty good vision from the north side, I think. Some pretty good vision. I think even... Uh, okay, we can't see the ground floor, but let's get the spotter in there. And then what about on the west side over here? We'll have eyes over here. We'll have eyes through here, blocked by this wall, though. Uh, eyes through this window, able to look right through over here. Very small area to actually look at. What about on the ground floor? Ah, eh, just a small window over here. Not really ideal. I think south side's probably going to be the other side. I want to put some spotters down on. Get eyes on the other side of some of these walls. Yeah gives us, I think, the best coverage. So, south side support with a tactical spotter. Do we get, like, an east side sniper or something? We do have good uh, viewing angles, now that I look at it from the east side. Mm hmm. Maybe rather than north side, we go east side. Spotter and sniper, and I think smoke as well, to be perfectly honest. As long as this building doesn't block our angles, which it shouldn't, that would be absolutely resoundingly stupid. But uh, I guess time will tell. All right. We've got two deployment zones. One's over here. One's over here. We're going for this one because there's more loot nearby. And uh, let's just hope that Clover gets deployed in the right spot. Again, with her interconnected uh, talent, that means that we just have to shut down one uh, you know, security terminal and they all turn turn off. So that's going to help us out a lot. The enemy's dug in deep. Prepare for a tough fight. And of course, we're basically in the middle of nowhere. Basically in the middle of nowhere. Eliminate all opposition from up over here. Really? You couldn't get me close to... I mean, I guess I could jump down over here and then go through the doors. That's a little silly. 
I would like to take care of this since we're already up here. Um. Okay, well, I suppose we've got time. I can actually see the agent already, so that's that is definitely helpful. He's up over here. Oh, would you look at that. There's actually a whole other floor. In fact, wait a second. Um, really? I could just sniper from this building right here? Uh, that would be pretty funny. 110 hit points. I could take her down, but it looks like she's not moving. So let's hold off on the sniper shot for now. Clover, we're going to take our time a little bit. Let's go ahead and uh, get what we need from here first. Let's go. There we go. Good stuff. Off to a good start. And then I wonder if we jump down right away and start making our way over. If we jump down, we can go through this door and then through a couple steps. We got to go down through this door, this door, this window, this window, and then we get to the terminal here. Okay. Well, let's get to it. Let's get to it. And let's see. I still have vision up here? Do I? No, I don't. I don't still have vision up here. That's the only harm in coming down like that, I guess. Let's see if we can't get Indigo out to the side or something, though. Let's see. Um, I do want to get somebody up here to deal with this loot. This is a locked door, so, well, we're not going to use the door over there. Uh, but let's get Bush Baby and Falcon going there anyway. So, Falcon, let's get you up to... I'm a little nervous about this window. Let's see if we can't see anything from over here. No vision. I think there's only one agent, though. So as long as I don't get recognized by an agent, I should be fine. Bush Baby will pull you with. Let's get you over to here. And then Indigo, we can pull you off to the side here, or even up to here, I suppose. Or up to here. The full cover, please. I don't mind full cover. Alright. Still can't see the agent. Yeah, I think we have to be up here. Well, at least I can... I know that I can pop, pop my uh, tactical spotter here. And, uh, and see the agent. And we know that they're not moving anytime soon, so there's that. Now, Theremin. Is there a camera in here that we're... Oh, no, it's Buddy over here, I think, able to... No, what is, what is causing this vision cone? Hmm, no clue. No clue. But, Theremin, let's get you up here with Bush Baby and Falcon as well, I think. And let's get this over Duck with. Nose, let's get you up with Indigo, I think, because Buddy here, I think, is going to come towards us. Yeah. So maybe we can work together and knock him down over there. So let's move Duck Nose over there. Again, if we just quickly... I kind of don't want to snipe the enemy agent. I'm wondering if I want to take him. But on the flip side, I have an easy out right now. You know what I mean? I can easily just assassinate... And I don't think anyone's going to see her. Which is the biggest... That, that's the biggest benefit, is that no one's going to notice her be taken care of. Um, so I can move all the way down to here. Move all the way over to here. Neither is really fast. Oh, there's a laser grid over here. Okay, so we have to go this way. Let's... Let's, uh... Let's go over to here. And hopefully I didn't, like, miss a laser grid somewhere. Yeah, we're good. Alright, so hop, hop, turn that off. We'll be good. So, Duck Nose... Yeah, oh, no, no, no. This camera can see us right now. Where are you going next? You're turning around and going back? Okay, that's too bad. So, that's good in the way that it at least gives us another cycle that we have to wait. Over here as well, the camera is very much active. And he'll move by the window next. So, let's move on over to... Here, we'll prepare ourselves for the next turn. Move you over to here Let's and Theremin. Let's get you up over to here, I think. Only need them two at a time. So let's Leave go. Alone. And then Duck Nose and Indigo, yeah. I guess you guys can stay over here. I'm kind of wondering. I do have that ladder over there I could always take. But how much uh, how many hit points did she have again? 110 was it? Get the spotter spotting over I think it was hereabouts. And confirm this is the spotter, not my smoke grenade. Cool. There we go. Ah. You do move around. Okay, good, good, good. I'm glad I checked. Glad I checked. So 110. 
gonna turn this way though. I wonder if we can't sneak up to here. She shouldn't be able to see a straight drop down. Though she moves all the way to the edge, so... I don't know about that. I could move in to go up to here. And then next turn we could keep moving forward. And Clover, you're done. Duck Nose, you're gonna be taking this guy out, hopefully. Die, yeah. And then Falcon and Bush Baby will hopefully take this guy out soon. Theremin, maybe we pull back to help dispose of this body. I think that makes sense. And I just want to check where evac's available. Here, here, and here. Okay, so this... Not this one. But this this one is closest to the enemy agent if we actually want to extract them. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Bush baby. Um, let's get you... Let's get you over to here. Might as well minimize how much moving we're doing afterwards. And let's get you over to here. He'll eventually come back here. I imagine that's his uh, patrol. I think I should just snipe the enemy agent, to be honest. At least I can see her now. Ooh, okay, so she can't see all too well. She can only see up to there when she's up there. Okay. I can move a little bit closer to Buddy here. He's going to fall back to here. She's going to go that way. So this might be my chance to take this guy out. So he's staying put... F oh, he's actually going that way. And he's coming this way. So they're swapping around. Interesting. Interesting. And Buddy here is coming over to here. Alright, so you know what? Indigo, let's get ready to take this guy out. Move you over to here. And Duck Nose, move you over to here. I want to take him down. I want to dispose of his body, and then I want to move up and take the agent down shortly thereafter so that the alert doesn't get pulled. You're going to keep moving that way. You're going to come in this way, and the cameras are going to be off. I wonder if I should... Let's, let's do the cameras first. We can pick up the loot on our way out. So let's go over to here. And this should shut down everything. All security oh. disabled. Yep, that's everything. All the cameras. The uh, laser grid here as well. Yes, everything is off. And we can go towards the uh, loot now. Yes. Let's go ahead and do that. Falcon. Okay, where is Buddy coming to? coming up to here but what what can see us only him i think they're gonna turn around all right so let's position ourselves to take this guy down move over to here bush baby move over to here again we can't take too many of them down at the same time because that'll trigger an instant uh, alert not an alert but they'll grow wary immediately i'm just short over here okay let's get theremin up to here He's eager. He's eager. He wants to get involved. He's so used to being so very involved. Okay, Falcon Bush, baby, you're waiting. That end turn button. We should be good. We should be good. Alright, so. Duck nose. Alright, let, let's see, let's see. Indigo, can you actually get up here right now? No. She's gonna keep moving, but you can get pretty close. If we pop her, uh, her extra movement, we'll be able to get to the base of the ladder. And so next turn, I should be able to get up and take her out. All right. So let's go ahead with Indigo doing the takedown. Right? No one's going to notice. No one's going to see. Just a fire point. So let's confirm that. Okay. Here we go. Down you go. And then we're going to give Indigo her exertion. So low on awareness. If things go wild right now, she's going to take a lot of bullets. She's going to take a lot of bullets. All right, now let's move her all the way up to... Yes, I was right, the base of the ladder. I hope you don't turn around to see me or something. That would be quite unfortunate. Okay, away we go. We should be safe to go up and take down the enemy agent. And Duck Nose, before we forget, let's dispose of this body, please, and thank you. There we go. 
I'm actually wondering what to do about the civilians down here. How do we extract the enemy agent? Well, there... No, no, this guy can see the door. We're gonna have to take them down, I think, actually. Which is unfortunate. I like to minimize civilian casualties. But I feel like it's gonna be necessary here. Okay, very well. Very well, not a problem. Over here, are we able to take this guy down? We are. Sure, so let's go ahead and... Got you over there. Not able to see us. One, two, and three. So yes, let's take him down and let's dispose of the bodies of Falcon. Oh, no, we do get noticed. Yeah. Who sees us? Oh, you're looking our way. Okay, fair enough. See, this is what I mean. Like, it doesn't highlight red, even though it should. Um, why does it say it's not... It's only an emergency if she does it. I guess because she's in that spot over there. Okay, well, just to be safe, just to double check, let's move Falcon over to here. It says I can take him down. Okay. I guess I will. Yeah, his vision ends right where Falcon was standing earlier. Okay, fair enough. So he should be okay. Take down, take down, confirm. Yep, down you go. And Bush Baby with the body die, disposal. Yeah. Please and thank you. No one's going to notice. No one's going to know. Perfect. Very smooth. And now... And now we could... Well, Buddy here is going to go all the way up to there. So we could get Bush Baby up to here and Falcon could get pretty close as well. Let's do that. Falcon, let's get you over to here. I think that's close enough that we can double team this guy. Because again, once the enemy agent goes down, it's all fair game. I can go in, no problem. Buddy over here is going to come this way. Fair enough. Clover, let's get you in here, I think, dealing with the uh, loot. In we go. Pop this thing open. Nicely done. And what else have we got? Some stuff on the second floor, if I recall correctly, over here. Yes. Wonder if I should send somebody up these stairs to go and check this stuff out. Probably not. Clover could probably be the one that goes up these stairs. Or I could send her in through here up these stairs, taking these guys down as she goes along. Let's do that. And then Theremin, let's move you around the side here, perhaps. What could you do for us? You'd give us a vision over here, maybe pick up this intel over here. Sure, that's not a bad task for an eager man. Let's not go through the door, please. Go over to here first. And then... I guess I could pop the door open. I don't need to. Over to here. Alright. Duck nose is all that's left. Could pull... Du well, this guy's gonna be taken down by Bush Baby and Falcon. Duck nose. Do we actually send you up here in preparation to take down some civilians? God, that feels bad. And I do worry about... For spotting us. Let's pull Duck Nose back to here. In case we can do something here instead. That's the turn. Please, let's not get spotted. Please don't let an emergency be triggered. Nothing suspicious at all. <laughs> Alright, we're good so far. You, we cannot see anymore, so let's get our spotter spotting over here. Confirm that. Hopefully she's looking the wrong way and everything. Yes, excellent. So Indigo is able to get up there. Perform the take... No. Not enough awareness. Okay, so... I suppose we could stay down here and... Hit ourselves... Like, do the whole Zen thing. I think this person goes up there and then looks back down. Which would be quite unfortunate. Quite unfortunate indeed. Mm. Oh, at least this person leaves. Okay, good. So one of them leaves. That's a positive sign. Fine. Indigo, you stay there. She should not be able to see us. Even if she looks our way, she should not be able to see us right up against the wall. So we're going to pop our zen or our focus ability, I guess. Confirm that. This is a good idea. Unfortunately, it takes a fire point, so I can't, um, can't go in for the takedown. But that's okay, that's okay. Indigo, stay there. 
over here. I think we're gonna have to, I think we'll give it another turn. He's going back and forth. We, we've got this zone covered, so that's fine. Theremin, we're gonna pull you over to the wall over here just to peek through the windows. See that it's clear. Oh, there's some loot here as well. Excellent. Excellent. Next turn though, next turn. I wanna make sure we can do it all in one go. Clover's done over here. Clover, we're gonna send you over to here, up the stairs. Through a different window, of course. Gotta help the uh, Soviet economy. There we are. I read you. Uh, Duck Nose, Falcon, and Bush Baby are Jeez, all on hold. Indigo's else. on hold. Ah, bit of a bit of a quieter turn than I would have liked. Not the end of the world, but okay. Buddy's moving away. Don't sneak I up do on think like Indigo. That. Yeah. Okay. So we should be good to get up here and take the agent down. Oh. That's a guy. I thought it was a girl. Or are there two agents up here? Hmm. Better safe than sorry. Let's cover all of our bases. So confirm that. I don't want to risk anything silly over here now. And let's get uh, second spotter. Spotting over here. Spotter, yes, confirm. Okay. Now it looks like we're good. Looks like we're good. Okay, so Indigo, you can go up, you can take this guy down, and then we can maybe pull him downstairs. If we have some time. Alright, so let's get on up here. Going for the takedown, no one's gonna notice, supposedly. Yeah, confirm it. Sure? Here we go. Watch, we get spotted. Looks like we're good. Down you go, 600 XP. Whew. Very nice. All right, now we can go in. We can pick up the intel. We've got somebody here, but they're still looking that way, so that's cool. Let's go in and pick up the intel. Why? Oh, this door is this door's not open. How can you see through it? Or is there another person here? Oh, this person's able to see there. Very interesting map. All right, cool. So let's move in. We can pick up the intel, and then we'll pop right back out. No use staying in here, I don't think. I love that her animation actually had her look towards me, but she still didn't see me. Um, yeah, let's get out. Oh, we can't get out. I guess I'll have to... It seems wasteful. She's not gonna turn my way. And... He can't come back and see me from there. There's a wall there. So we should be fine. We should be fine to stay in here. Might as well move a little bit over this way. And hope it doesn't all go sideways. Now this buddy over here, we can take him down and then... Dispose of his body, both with Clover. And I think that's what I'm going to do. No one can see him, no one else is patrolling up here. We need to go over to the uh, intel and loot down over here. I don't think there's anything over here. Yeah, so there's loot here and there's intel here. So fine. So let's do this in one swoop here. So let's take you down. Down you go, buddy. There we go. Next turn, we'll dispose of the body. We might as well move on over to here. And I'm working towards getting more fire points and all for our people. Over here, we can get Bush Baby and Falcon taken down and disposing of the body. Who else can we see here? Buddy here. Okay, cool. So, Bush Baby, let's go ahead with the takedown. Confirm it. Down you go. And Falcon in there with the body disposal. Thank you very much. Nice and easy, nice and easy. So we've got three more people left. One I have seen. The other two I guess I'm looking for. My skills are at your the one that I've seen is over here. Uh, Duck Nose, I guess I can pull post you towards this window over here. Indigo is not used to being the only one carrying people. Let's actually get Duck Nose over to here. Just so we can see where these civilians go. I can see you and I can see you. Okay, cool. It's just, that's just it. I just want to keep my eyes on them. And Falcon, let's get you over to here looking through yeah. that window. And Bush, baby, let's get you over to here looking through this window. Because crisscrossing is cool. Clover's good up there. Ducknose is good over here. Well, I guess I can move her a little bit further if I wanted to. Sure, looking through this window over here. Knowledge is power. Ah, okay, you're moving. Okay, all good. All good, all good. Leave me alone. Clover, let's dispose of this body. 
I see another one, so that's good. My eyes on the prize, or on all the prizes, I guess. Body dispose, buddy's gonna go all the way up to there, so let's move up to intercept him, I suppose. You are gonna do what? You're gonna stay, nope, you're gonna come over to here, okay. Well, let's go ahead and intercept this guy first. This means we have to get back upstairs again. It's fine, not the end of the world. Wish there was another set of stairs. I guess there is over here. I've already got this intel. Okay, fine, fair enough, whatever. Well, we'll, we'll dive down. You're moving up to there, so we're gonna meet you over here. Don't mind me jumping down like this. Nothing suspicious at all. We're good. We're fine. Cool. And then Theremin, let's deal with you first. Let's get this taken care of. Nice and easy, there we go. Boom, done. Titanium firing pin. That sounds... That sounds cool. That sounds like something I'd want. Oh, I could actually go in for the takedown right now. Damn. I could actually go in for the takedown right now. There, I'm in. Always wanting to get involved. Do we? Shall we? Buddy here is not coming any closer. Six, seven. Where is number eight? Where is number eight? Hmm. Wish I knew where number eight was. Well, you know what? You know what? What is life without some risks? Am I right? you damn right I am. Now it's party time. Let's do it. Down you go. I gotta. I have to level Theremin up, so I have to use him whenever possible. Uh, otherwise, otherwise I'm being foolish. I don't necessarily want to dive into here because there are civilians around these parts. And they might, you know, look out the window or something and, and see me, which I don't like. I mean, if he stays, or if she stays, he, if they stay where they are, if anything, they're turning away from me. Should be good to go in and deal with this. Why am I, why am I taking these risks? Why am, why am I doing that? I don't know why I'm doing that. Let's 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 be careful here. Let's be careful here. Indigo, you need to pick this agent up. And can we move right now? You're staying there, you're staying here. So yes, let's pick up the agent. Fortunately, it cost me a movement point. See what scares me is can I get far enough? This turn we're not gonna use exertion. Right? Oh, okay. Well, I can't get farther than the edge of this anyway. How do we have somebody up here, but we're still not able to see everybody? Oh, no, we are. So you're number seven. Oh, no, yeah. I'm not able to see number eight. That's what it was. We'll find it. We'll find it. Let's pull Indigo back to the uh, ladder over here, I suppose. Hopefully no one sees us up here with a body over our shoulders. Uh, Duck Nose is over yeah. here. Let's get Falcon actually over to here as well. In case we need to take both of those civilians out, I want to make sure I'm in position for that. Bush baby. I mean, is there anything in here? No, there is not. Is there anything worth sending Bush baby in for? I don't think so. So let's pull Bush baby over to here. Duck knows you're fine. We're fine. Ah, it's too bad. It's so very tempting. I could do this, but. I took my gamble with Theremin already, so. Alright, there we go. Hurry up. They'll be here any okay, Indigo. Now. This civilian is staying over there, this civilian is staying over here. If we pop exertion, we'll be able to get to here. Alright, that that does give us cover with the walls. Alright, so let's go ahead and pop exertion. Confirm that. And let's go as far as we can get. Let's move Duck Nose out of the way. Move Duck Nose over to here, I suppose. Maybe not the best spot. Don't sneak up on me like that. So no, let's not. Let's not go indoors. Let's pull Duck Nose out to here. Sure. And that should let Indigo do this from outside. Yes. All right. All the way to the wall with a full cover. No one's gonna be able to see us over here. We had vision. We saw nobody. So we should be in the clear to do this. Time will tell. Down the ladder we go. Don't mind me, don't mind me. We're okay. Oh my god, these full body windows. is waltzing right past them. Don't look at me, don't look at me. I'm good. Okay, we're fine. What up? <laughs> that that uh, that made me a little uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. 
Okay, so we've got this taken care of. I could dispose of the body and then get Theremin out of here. Um, or I could send Theremin towards the intel in here. Clover could do the same. There's somebody in here, and they might be able to see us go through. So you don't know. We're going to dispose of this body. Yes, please. And we're going to go out. We don't need to keep Theremin in here. It is a risk. It's a risk we don't need to take. Go out that way. We can go out this way. We're not able to see in here. So you know what? We're going to take the safety of what we know. Uh, dive out this window. Bam. Let's get this over with. All right, Clover. We're going to send you in here. We'll take a look at this intel. Oh, there's the other person. I see you now, buddy. I see you now. You're looking the wrong way, so that'll make it easy. Next turn for that. Falcon's over here. Let's get this over with. Bush baby's over here. Where is Buddy? He's gonna come down over here. So uh, actually, you know what? Next turn, I could send Bush baby in to take him down. Finish this all off. Next turn. In which case, alone. Falcon, I think we're good to actually pull you back as well, because none of these two are turning around anytime soon. So fine, yeah, let's send... Oh, that's not what I meant. I meant over to here. As close as you can get. Hopefully that's close enough. Hopefully that's close enough. That's the turn. Okay, Indigo has not been spotted, so we're all right. Uh, Indigo, let's, uh, let's keep moving. I wish I could have more exertion. You're not turning around. You are coming towards us, but that's okay. We'll be far enough away by the time you get here. Move on over. And I might want to call it evac right now because we're about to finish the mission off. We're going to be picking up intel and stuff, but, you know, that's fine. It's not like we're on a time limit as long as our cover hasn't been blown. So let's call it evac. Away. And let's get all this stuff done as well. Clover, push you in to do the takedown. We can't get Theremin in to do the takedown, unfortunately, because locked doors. I wouldn't mind getting him more XP, but... Let's go. This poor guy. Last thing he sees is the glass break, and bam! Down he goes. All right, we, we do... Uh, we don't need to dispose of that body, I suppose, but I should dispose of that body. Um, of course, this guy's looking this way, but he's going to turn around next turn, go over to there... And we'll... If we were here, we'd be able to take him out. Duck Nose, where are you? I guess you're getting involved after all, Duck Nose. Leave me alone. And Who Indigo, she's done her move. Yeah. Theremin, let's get you moving towards Evac. I think this is probably the faster path. Yes, I think so. Let's go ahead and pop um, Exertion, just so we're moving Super faster. Fun. Try and get out of here as quickly as possible. Obviously, without forgetting our intel and stuff. Just looking to pick that up. Can't leave without all of our intel and stuff. All right, let's go. I think that all that's left is all on the second floor, if I'm not mistaken. Which Clover's going to go half, going to have to go after, My after we dispose of that body. Disposal. Duck knows next turn. Hopefully, uh, he's probably going to look that way. It's fine. We'll find our chance. We'll find our chance. I think actually Bush Baby might be able to do it then. Bush Baby. Wait a second. Ho 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 ho! Forgot about this friend of ours here. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. If I pop Exertion, we'll get all the way, so that's good. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Just need to make sure Indigo gets into a spot where... She won't be seen. All right, in we go for the takedown. Confirm that through the window. Bush baby gets some more XP as well. Down you go, buddy. Reporting primary objective so, complete. Indigo. Let's get Indigo over to here in this corner. As this friend of ours goes this way, he'll probably be looking out this way or to this side. So we should be fine over here. And then later on, we can keep circling around him, basically. But yes, let's uh. Let's tuck into the corner over here, shall we? I'm glad I saw his uh, his vision markers. Otherwise, I'd be in a uh, bit of trouble. All right, we're good in the corner there. Need me? Theremin, we're going to keep pulling you away, my good friend. Down this way. Yeah. And Clover. Clover, Clover, Clover. I need to get you on the second floor. I need to get you towards this. What is the fastest way to get there? 
feel like it's these stairs. Let's go. I should have popped exertion on her, actually, now that I think about it. It's okay. Not the end of the world. Uh, Duck Nose is right here. Could dispose of the body. Probably should dispose of the body. I mean, we're in here either way, so what difference does it make? Just more money for the Soviet economy, I suppose. All right, away with that body. Falcon, let's get you... Let's get you over to here in case our friend decides to get a little eager and we need to take him down. Just in case. Just in case. All right, where are you? You're here. You're staying there for the next little bit. Okay, good. Theremin, let's rush you as far as you can go. Clover. We're going to get you... I think I'm going to pop Exertion, finally. And we want to get over to where? Here. Which means over to here. Huh. Could have just gone here from up here. Damn it. Well, nonetheless, we've got this and we've got this. So... Exertion, yes, please. Come on, pump yourself with drugs. True Olympians. And... As far as you can get. Cool. Duck Nose, let's pull you out and over to here. Bush yeah. Baby, same with you. We're going to pull you out and over to here. I guess you can go farther. I uh, know you'll get spotted there, so let's not do that. Let's do this. And no one is any wiser. Indigo, you're fine there because Buddy's still looking up that way. Not going to turn around anytime soon. Falcon, you're fine here in case you need to shut this nonsense down. And that's the turn. Evac's going to arrive now. We should be clear. We should be clear. Let's skip that. Don't need to see it. Theremin, buddy, let's get you down all the way to here. Yeah. And let's actually check real that? quick where this guy's going next. He's staying put. Let's get this over with. Some really suspicious activity about to start happening around him. I hope he's uh, up for it. Let's make our way over to here. I hope that's all there's left to pick up. I think so. I think I've been pretty thorough. Yeah, I can see this being all that there's all that there's left to pick up. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Hmm. So this is where uh, I kind of just go. Okay, well, I don't really want to spend hours looking around the map and boring boring everybody that's watching. So it's fine if I leave it behind. Rather not, but uh, I can't find it right away. I don't know if I'll spend too much time on it. All right, we're good. Indigo's waiting over here. Falcon's waiting over here. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Pretty much home free. Clover, gotta pick this up first, and then we'll go ahead with the intel. Six out of seven. Ah, so we are missing something. I remember, I th I'm pretty sure I spotted it already when we were scouting. Now let's just do a quick rundown here. So there's nothing up over here. There's nothing up over here. We saw this loot. We saw this intel. We saw this loot. Um, what else do we see? Everything on this floor I think we've taken care of. Right, and then down here, we already took care of this loot over here. Mm. Okay, no loot there, no loot in here, at least from this angle. Right, we took care of the loot in this corner. Alright, let's rotate. This is how I saw, I think, the loot in the corner here. Uh, where, where could I have missed it? Where could I have missed it? Missing a loot and some classified docks. I'm hoping it's on the second floor. I'm hoping it's close to Clover, but it does not look to be the case. There isn't anything up here. There is not anything down here. Wish I'd marked where the other... Uh, camera terminal was because sometimes they do stay together the camera terminals and the uh, 
Intel and loot. What about over here? Oh, there we go. There it is. So it is on the second floor. Cool. Clover can get it. No problem. You are still looking that way. Excellent. Theremin, let's get you down here. Duck nose, let's get you in here. Falcon, let's keep you up there just in case. And go, you can stay over there. Alright, cool. Oh, God. Why did it look like he was not gonna move? Alright, well, it's fine. That's fine. Evac compromised in two turns. That's not so fine. All right, Clover. We might need to give up on that last piece of intel and loot. Oh, stupid civilian here. If I dive out, we should be able to make it in two turns. It's unfortunate because I did spend all that time looking for it, but hey, it is what it is. Confirm that. Let's leave. Was I just blind to the blue marching ants? I might have been. I think I might have been. All right, well, we can rush over to here, and we should be able to get to evac right away, no problem. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Falcon might as well get you in here as well. So one, two, three, four, five. And then Clover's the only one waiting. That is really too bad. I guess I was just blind. I guess I just wasn't paying attention. That's how you know you're doing good spy work when you're not paying attention. Ah, I was going so smoothly too. At least no shots are gonna fly, though I am tempted to shoot this civilian right square in the face. Um, no one has to die today. No one has to die today. Let's move on back to here, and let's get the hell out of here. Yes, we have everybody. Let's go. That's too bad. God damn it. God damn it. Had to leave some things behind. I'm gonna check the recording and see how blind I truly was. It's fine, though. It's not the end of the world. We got everything we wanted. We got an agent. We got most of the intel and uh, loot. All good. Completed the mission relatively quietly. Got ourselves an AMR at semi-12. What is this? Titanium firing pin. Ooh, extra damage. Nice. That'll help counter our... Uh, that'll help counter... Damage lost due to suppressors a bit more. PM63. Wow, that's a lot of damage output on a burst and a full auto. And then lighter. Yes, we have acquired him. Sunspots investigation talent revealed. Cool trade contact for an evac chopper. Nice. Sunspots advantage firearms talent revealed. Cool enemy revealed and new agent candidate. Good stuff. Everyone's been compromised. So that's a lot of money that needs to be spent. That's fine. Not the end of the world. It's too bad that Theremin didn't uh, level up as well, but Clover did. Clover did. Where are we? Clover. What can we get you? We have quite a few options with her, actually. And she is a pretty solid agent. We're probably going to be taking her on all missions moving forward. So what do we want to make her proficient with? I mean, I do like her double PPK action. Maybe give her something that, I guess... I don't know. I don't know. Not sure what to give her, but I'll think about that later. Uh, I will have to, for one, get some interrogation going on over here. We'll get that control phrase in afterwards. Interrogation takes how long? 20 hours. So the control phrases will be cheaper as soon as it happens or as soon as uh, it's available. So interrogate, locator, control phrase, release. Or do we go down the whole list? Interrogation for now. Get some more intel off of him. And let's... Uh, it's going to be expensive. 460 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 24... What, 2600 plus? Over 2600 bucks? It's fine. I'll do that between sessions, because all of these... I'm just going to keep them the same names and all, so I'll do that between sessions. We don't have to watch that, but we do want to get into the investigation board, because Complex Minutes has been completed, Operation Mud Bath might be completed, and Operation North Star. We need more intel on this still, but uh, let's go with Complex Minutes for now. Congratulations, comrades. Mudhead says that the Iraqis have been driven out of Khuzestan, and now Khomeini's even more of a hero than before. What? How did that happen? I'm told that's because the Iranians had help from Redacted. That's sabotage. Actually, it's all exactly as planned. With the Iraqis humiliated, the war will fester for at least a couple more years. And since we're best friends to both of them, we'll make sure they have enough to sustain the hostilities. Joy. Alright, let's pull all this out. NSA, there we go. Okay, let's see. Just trying to keep an eye on everything as it comes out. You know, when there's stuff to keep an eye on. 
think tank coal stream. Nope, none of that yet. Nothing yet. Whiskey rock CC, nothing yet. Oop, good stream, not cold stream. And whiskey rock, I saw as well. There we go. Bad company, nothing yet. Okay, let's do that. What else have we got? Uh, haven't seen any of these yet. Think tank I have seen, so let's get that hooked up over here. USMC up over here. All right. All right, off to a good start. Deep ocean. I know I saw that somewhere. Deep ocean, deep ocean. I know I saw it somewhere because I thought, well, shouldn't deep ocean and calamari be connected in a terrible joke that I wasn't going to say until it became relevant. Got that over there. And dilettante over here. Oh, so I guess uh, I guess Deep Ocean and Calamari are connected. I just one step removed. All right, let's get you. No, nope, let's get you over to here, and let's start looking. All right, Hooligan was stopped at Passport Control and redacted by bad company officers, and has been detained since yesterday. It appears that they are not aware of the agent's current affiliation. Okay. Is that okay? Over here. Let's see. Uh, these aerial photos of Redacted show the locations pinpointed by Big Daddy as containing Redacted weapons caches. We are sending Bonafide, 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 Pope, almost said Pop, uh, and Redacted to examine the sites and confirm or deny the intelligence. Please notify Jailbird about the operation. We don't want anyone interrupting our agents. Sincerely, Redacted. All right, we do know there's connections here. I saw Big Daddy before. I saw Pope before. Jailbird, I don't think we saw before. Oh, I just realized we see bad company here. Bam. Okay, pull this down over here. What do you got for me? Redacted, in reply to your recent memo, I see little interest in protecting the photographs from Alpha Dog. Consider, Mudhead has these images from own satellites. Redacted, redacted. If exposed, we can always say the work done there is classified. Televangelists have never been involved, etc. All right, televangelists have their fingers in every pie. It seems Alpha Dog, I thought I saw somewhere. I might be mistaken. No, there it is. Bam. And Mudhead, I definitely saw somewhere. Oh, that's the, the main one. Televangelist we haven't seen yet. Let's keep this off to the side here. We see a clear connection. Let's see what you've got for me. Lots of redacted info. My team, as well as that of Snowcat, cannot operate without these supplies. It is imperative that you parlay with redacted and put more pressure on Calamari. Moreover, be advised that K-Bomber's security is lax at best. Redacted reported that fragments of our research data were found in press gang cables. All right. So Calamari, bam. Uh, move you up here, move you over here. Snowcat. I thought I saw Snowcat somewhere. No, no, no. I was mixing that up with Lynx Claw. Um, K Bombers, Press Gang. I don't think I've seen that. Oh, no. I did see Snowcat somewhere. I goddamn knew it. Knew it. It is one of those feeling kind of blind sort of days, I guess. All right. This is a mess now. Let's. I need to clean this up. Move you over to here. Move you over to here. Move you over to here. You over here. I do think we've already solved this one. I get the feeling we've already solved this one, to be honest. It's a lot of connections. Boom. Yes. Analyze. New intel for Operation North Star Briefing. Sunspot's crafting talent revealed. And Vulture has been revealed as a new agent candidate. Uh, Sunspot. Good for you. Good for you. I wonder if, since Sunspot isn't doing anything... Uh, do I, I don't have to manufacture the evac helicopter, so let's go ahead and get some more rifle suppressors happening. If anything, we can just sell them. If anything, we can just sell them. And you know what? I should actually get some people on comms here. Ducknose was on comms for a little while, so let's get you back here. Oh, Clover's actually good at it, so fine. Let's get Clover there, and let's get Ducknose here. Worst case scenario, um, Clover has to stop working in the middle of a job, though I don't know how likely that'll be. Okay, back to our investigation board i wonder if we're good enough to dive in on this let's try it let's try it so operation north star goal help bring about or orchestrate an international tragedy caused by misnavigation creating a public outcry that'll force the government to make global positioning system available for public use this is related to our long-term strategy for project iceberg man that is terrifying i like this game is obviously fictional but like you read some of these things and you go you know <laughs> you know you never know you never know uh sabotage of the navigation system the bug in the system will be activated on a specific date programmed into the software beforehand 
The airliner deviates along the pre-programmed course, entering Soviet airspace in the redacted area. The Soviets are expected to react according to procedure, but if they take too long to make the call and the plane approaches international airspace again, Phase 3 comes into effect. Phase 3, our asset in the Soviet Air Force, ensures the shooting down of the plane. Given the geographical location of Operation North Star, make sure to have extra security at golf course, given that all communications will be going through their local relay. Mmm, this one's juicy. This one is quite juicy. All right. Got an umbrella gun over there, looks like. Pull this out. Ah, there's CC again. Zeitgeist, Wolf Gang, Plane Spotters, Insect Bites. See, Golf Course, Girl Friday. Trouble Kid, Foxtrot Dan. Oh my god. Zeitgeist is a connection we already have. Okay. Let's start. So, Zeitgeist up over here. Haunted House, Mathematicians, Popular Venue. Golf Course is the main connection. Foxtrot, Dancer, Patriot, Bramble, Jinx. Hmm, I wouldn't be surprised if we don't have this one yet, but who knows, we might get lucky, right? Sank Kujo said you needed the right person for the airliner op, so here are a few candidates. Redacted, Redacted, Soviet Air Force Commander, 14 years of experience, has some gambling debts and can't pay them. We worked together before in Vladivostok. Alright. I don't know why that would tuck under here, but alright. Up here. Redacted asked us to follow Redacted during their visit in Track 7. Following the allegations of involvement with Redacted, Jinx and Redacted were dispatched. Redacted provided support. Lots of Redacted information. Arrival at Track 7 at 12.42. Lots more information here. We suspect the abduction was orchestrated by either by K-Bombers or two Virginians. Okay. K-Bombers was in the other one. Track 7 Jinx I saw somewhere, didn't I? Yeah, there's Jinx right there. Pull you two closer together. Um, Bramble. Yeah, I thought I saw Bramble. There it is. Pull you two closer together. Alright, I feel like this is all loose ends over here. Alright, Redacted. There's a bunch of lucid dream agents sniffing around Conquistador's house in Redacted. They're salesmen and Redacted. Lots of Redacted. Funky peelers? Question mark. That's just <laughs> a random little s statement there. All right, um, main sail. So transcript recorded between main sail and redacted. Lots of redacted info. Doesn't match redacted or anyone from that side of the fence. Could be from Fable, based on clothing choice. He started following you after you left the good neighbors meeting. All right, so Fable we saw up here. Main sail I did not see anywhere. All right, yeah, it feels like we don't have this one. So verify something. Verify redacted activities in haunted house. As for briefing two J, redacted, redacted. Follow up on recent main sail sighting. Well, there's main sail. Redacted, double check info from Division H about Redacted getting friendly with Redacted. Start in Redacted. Okay, so mains. Oh, I missed one. How did I miss one? I guess it is just one of those blind days, isn't it? One of those days. All right, main sale. Let's hook you up over here. And who else have we got? Division H is connected here. This, I mean, feel, it doesn't feel like a completed thing. I, there, I saw Haunted House as well. So priority report, Big Daddy was stopped at Passport Control and redacted by Lucid Dream officers and has been detained since yesterday. It appears that they are not aware of the agent's current affiliation. All right, so first of all, first of all, Haunted House, hook you up over here. i pull you over the side here. Golf course, let's pull you out. Big Daddy, Big Daddy, Big Daddy. Where are you, Big Daddy? I could have sworn I saw it somewhere, like right now. No, I guess I'm mistaken. Oh, that was the previous one, right. And Lucid Dream, did I see that anywhere? Yes, I did. There it is. Not connected to anything else just yet, though. Let's see. CC, Lizard Men, Trouble Kid, Foxtrot, Dancer, Patriot, Two Virginians, Track 7, K-Bombers, Sank Cujo, Girl Friday, Brush Pass, Good neighbors, space cadet, wine taster. Nothing else connects, but let's take a risk here. Yeah, nope, nothing yet. Nothing yet, but at least we know. At least we know we're headed in the right direction here. All right, well, still some more intel to pick up over here, evidently. And still, we do have another document, which might give us all the intel we need. So I've been looking into Redacted, and it gave me an idea for our guys in Hollywood. Yeah, like what? A TV series. They're the secret agent. Let's call them signal officers for now. And he or she is looking into these weird cases. Shit like ghosts, aliens, UFOs, and so on. Now, is that relevant to our job here? Shut up and listen, will ya? Among those files are actual ops, only mixed up and blown out of proportion. You know, homie. <laughs> you know, homie. You know, homie? Is this like homie? Like, 
like, yo, homie, what's up? Or is this homie, like, homie? Like a homie lass or whatever. Anyway, uh, so even if someone digs up our dirty laundry, the public will tell them they got it from a fucking TV series. I'm gonna have to censor myself. Uh, let's see. Um, TV series, there's a secret agent that's called them signal officers. Okay. Here's a red herring to detract the public from the actual research it redacted. Hire a con artist who'll claim he worked there. Give a minor verifiable info, e.g. the site's code name, Deep Ocean. He or she says the facility has actual UFO tech, makes bullshit, unverifiable claims. E.g. the UFO is powered with Element 115. Pick something close to the stability island so it sounds more plausible. Guy boasts degrees from prestigious technical schools. Of course, there are no records of him. Of course, he says that they've been erased to discredit him. You get the gist. God. One of those stories. All right, Leningrad. Let's hook you up first. There we go. Get this up here. Algiers, let's get you up here. I'm trying to get this one done so we can get uh, the other one done. Down tick mainsail. There's mainsail again. Signal officer. No, not here. There we go. Noctambulus. What the hell does that mean? We actually don't have all the intel for this one either. Right. Oh. Definitely feels like we don't. Let's see. Surveillance report by Navy Blue Inc. 2107. Wow, with a colon. Target departed offices via taxi in the company of an individual matching the description of redacted, proceeding north into the center of Brussels. And then much later, target reached freeway of overpass and jumped before sea line could intervene. Where did Brussels go? There it is. Navy blue ink is over here. So let's pull these together. Sea line I don't think I've seen yet. There we go. And let's do this. All right. Dave, sorry to break it to you. Real name. But the real John is dead. All of them died in a plane crash in Necropolis back in 1964 during their final tour. Damn. Lots of Redacted. You ask me how I know? Well, there's this dude going by the name of Fixer, and he's worked for Redacted back in the day. He knows stuff. Very well. Necropolis. Did we see Necropolis anywhere? No. No, we did not. Fixer we did. All right. Downspout, day 99, lots of redacted information. Shouted at several shoppers, Mr. Gray was forced to intervene with oral trigger, partial success. Redacted, redacted mainsail tells me that this was his childhood home. Subject slept in car. Buccaneers has a commercial containing part of the ter tertiary trigger phrase and has been playing in the breaks of subject's favorite TV shows. Man, it's all this crazy, crazy talk. All right, we've got that. We have Buccaneers over here. Uh, it doesn't look like we've got everything. Did I see signal officer somewhere, or am I just playing with my with myself? That's the main thing, right? Okay, so yeah, looks like we're nowhere near done this one. Unless I'm missing something. Looks like we're nowhere near done this one. All right, very well. Well, next session we're going to be uh, well interrupting this operation, and then I guess we give it some time. Hope something more comes out. We've got some signal analysis going on, so hopefully we'll get some more intel out of that. It is that mission was. I mean, we almost pulled it off perfectly. I must have just turned a blind eye to the marching ants at the end there and let that civilian spot us. We should have taken him down. We should have killed him, but it's fine. Just got to spend some money and uh, forge some IDs. We'll be all right. As always, if you enjoyed this episode and you enjoy this series, please let me know that I should keep going by dropping a like and a comment down below. It does make a very big difference uh, with Let's Plays, especially as time goes on. And uh, I appreciate just knowing that you guys are still interested in seeing more definitely sounds like it a massive thanks as well of course to all of my patrons and channel members for supporting of the channel on a month-to-month -month basis keeping us alive and rolling smoothly until next time as always thank you very much for watching and that's